Excellent. Okay, so this is my presentation about research on pre-production techniques. The first one I looked at was storyboards, which is um, good for when making films. So you can like list the graphics and like the process of how the film will go along. So you'd start off with maybe the opening scene and then move it on. A spider diagram is um, the next thing I looked at. This is good for mind mapping your idea. So you could have the central idea, which may be the thing that you developed in the storyboard, and then have little lines come off it to have a better explanation of what you're going to do. And then the last thing I looked at was a mood board, which is good for graphic designers, so you can like have all the colours maybe that they're going to use, write down all the text that they're going to use. And it's really good to like get a map of exactly what you're going to do in one. Um, do you have any questions about that? Very fast. Yeah, I sort of. Because why don't you just approach it again, just slow it down a bit, and um, is that is that it now? Yeah, that was it. I thought you had a lot of information up on the screen. Yeah, that's basically what I did. I don't know exactly. Could have enlarged on it a little bit, a bit more. For example, like I said before about the storyboard, um, and what I mean the spider diagram. What advantages does it have? And you can sort of like interlink two different parts of the process. So you could have, say, um, one part of your film, you could have interlinked to another bit, and that would explain how the process is going to go. Okay, uh, as opposed to um, what a list are. It's better than a list because then you get more of a visual thing, so you can see exactly how they link in together. Rather than the list. Okay, so that's something I think you could have brought out a bit more in the, in the presentation. And this is a generic comment, um, I, mean, that mean, I mean across everybody's presentation, um, just to sort of consider that um, there were more than, like, I mean you're covering more than one pre-production document, there's not, there's not a one a definitive document, and that they've all got various strengths and their weaknesses obviously as well with that. Um, so... Yeah, the, uh, the spider. I mean, you had a lot of stuff up there. Do you want to just call the slide back up? Mm. Oh, that was it. That's the storyboard. Yeah, it's the storyboard one. Yeah. He could have done with some uh, graphics to show. Yeah, that's To show what a storyboard actually looks like, rather than describing it in text. Um... Okay. My diagram created at the start of the project. And if I would say, if you wanted, I know the, the screen's bad, but I mean, can anyone read that? Can everyone? I could read it. When it was full size, yeah. yeah. Huh? When it was full size, it was fine. Yeah, but maybe make it a touch bigger. Yeah. Just as a general presentational comment, because you got to remember, not everyone's got great eyesight. And okay. The, the, the screen's not perfect here, but in terms of presentation, sometimes you have to take that into into account. Maybe make the font bigger, or I'll spread that across two pages. Um, okay, thanks. And that was Paul. Yeah, thanks, Paul.